engage just who I like. Welcome back. At that time. To fate. You're like constant. <laughs> yeah. Circle around. Okay. Apparently. Apparently that's how it is, so. That's what Constantine does. I guess that's what I do too, so. So, your date, I guess you'd call it, also yeah. went reasonably well. Give me a d20 roll, please. <clears throat> Add your, uh, you don't, uh, what skills do you have? Alright, I guess it wouldn't matter, you got plus five to charisma anyway, so. Oh, oh, oh no, that's a four. four. Wow. <laughs> that's a nice. All right. <laughs> Come on. It's not a super great time. Like, Can it's I like, use like, it's... like it gets a little awkward. But briefly. Well, okay, that's fine. You know, but like, it it's wasn't... also a dragon and an orb. Yeah, it so... wasn't, it wasn't terrible. He's, he's still a little bit confused by what's going on with it. I mean, he's kind of getting the gist of what you're trying to do, or who you're trying to do in this case, and, and uh, he's not sure yet okay. about his his stance on that process. Okay. Uh, <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> okay. I have a thing for orcs, guys. Except for Imsh. He's well, only half orc. It's well, not half cool. too. Imsh was my friend beforehand, so I'm not going to go after him. I'm also normally a bear, too. <laughs> That's true. Most of the time. Uh, well, I'm normally a dragon. That so is honestly, true. We're, we're, we're past those boundaries at this point. True enough. That's why I'm going and for an orc, because that's the most exotic thing now, on the ship. I also like. We shall sail again. Buses. After a couple of days in Adasai. Have, having some good times all around. You get to know the crew a bit better. Kind of where they fit in. My gleaming the, muscles hoisting the mainsail. The, uh... <laughs> Glistening. The dwarven <laughs> yeah, guy what's, what's, there. What's the dwarf? My corded shows <laughs> The dwarf... Excellent question. Me and Sire are just like, man. <laughs> because that was the next person. This guy's very go. sexual. I was going to go talk to him. <laughs> Blaine's just seasick yeah. over the head. Yeah, I'm uh, over. Blaine is not seasick. She is fucking every guy that <laughs> we are not going. We're just, She's fucking every here. guy except Everyone. for Shump because I'm going after Shump and See, I will kill him. This is bit. what you should have done. That is, that's what Blaine is like, doing. Just say, hey. We're just gonna have sex. She's taken turns. <laughs> Belena's honestly fucked the dwarf. The the dwarf's name. Oh, we jiggle his. Is <laughs> Rorik. Roar. Roar. Are you? Everything's R happening right now. Yeah, Belena we paid Rorik <laughs> because she's a whore. Wait, Probably are they the prostitutes? <laughs> so what? What is? She it? fucked every guy on the ship. No, probably not. What is this? Uh, it's okay. I think she did because she's a whore. What does this dwarf do? His name is Rorik. Rorik. Uh, what do I want his last name to be? His goggles, they do nothing. Yeah, goggles, that's his last name. Torun. <laughs> Tor. Rorik Rorik Torun. T O R U N N. And he actually shows any of you who are interested, because you've got a lot of time to kill. Mm -hmm. And so, kind of to like not be so bored, he teaches you, because he can. How to use the rune cannons. Alright. Okay. Cool. Rune cannons are pretty rad. Uh, each shell has different properties in terms of what kind of damage it does. Uh, as far as their color. You know, like orange is fire, blue is ice, etc. Can you strap one of these on my back? No. Just walk around with it? No, it's pretty good stuff. Is this going to be an arcana thing, by the way? No, you just teach it. For like using it? Yeah. Not necessarily. No, you uh, just learn how to use it. Really proficient yeah. in rune They're like okay. they're they were pre-made canisters, and he like okay. pulls out one of the shells, and it's got kind of a glowy bullet part, you know, and then the shell is uh, it's it's actually at, the shells are adamantine, and they have some runes etched in them for like protecting. 
for protecting the shell, not that it needs it a whole lot, but also for like encapsulating the Artec and all of that. <clears throat> it takes a move action, for those of you who want to make a note of this, uh, it takes a move action to load it. This will be important. Yep. <laughs> this will be very important. Um, it takes a move action to Someone reload it. LOL. Uh, yeah. Was it me? Oh, oh, was it? That's not my handwriting. I did that. I think filled Move action to load. Move action to load. You, it, it's one shot per round. Per round that you use it. Um, Do you have another pencil, Gerald? I most assuredly. Oh, I wrote that LOL because I got you laid by that one woman that one time. Oh yeah, I remember that. Where did the That's bags? funny. Where did okay. The bag go? <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Hang on. Can you See, like some of my pages a, though were retyped. That's why. Yeah, yeah I need mean, pencil. Bag. I was just gonna write down what oh, he said. No, I haven't seen a pencil bag. It's a, no. Oh, is it? Oh, that was over there. Uh, here it is. So I got it. Pencil like, bag. In case anyone needs a pencil. Be longer videos. <laughs> no, ain't nothing wrong with that. It'll be, okay, fine. So It'll be fine. One action to load the cannon. Yeah, one action to load. Uh huh. Attack action to fire. A move action to load, I should say. Yep. Attack action to fire. It does. Oh, <sighs> much damage. Five D eight. Yeah, we need to get one of these and strap it on the back, guys. It does five D eight damage of the type of the shell. Yeah. Um, there are five five different types of shells. Kind of like the bandolier. Yeah. There's fire, ice, lightning, acid, fire, ice, thunder. lightning, and thunder. Yeah. yeah. So same thing as the bandolier. Like, so, yeah. yeah. Also, quick Ash. question. It's literally good for like a shit. And thunder. I just yeah. noticed Shell Swag's yeah. recharge on that special thing. It was the 1d3 minus 1. We don't have d3s. Do d3s even exist? You roll a d6. And minus 2? Well, like 1 and 2 is 1, 3 and 4 is 2. Oh, okay. Let's see. 5 and Got 6 it. is 3. Okay, so the cannon is 5d8. They do make d3s, but they're. Kind of pain in the ass. Trying to how that works. And they don't roll right. Yeah, that does. So the cannon's five d eight damage plus the element of like whatever. So shell you this put is in. kind of what a d three yeah. would be. Okay. Yeah. Okay. One shot um, of this. Actually, the um, typically when because I think that they do make these, but like a d three would have two ones, two twos, and two threes on it. It's just okay. like a d six. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. Cool. I like your lol, then Rainer. Yeah. I think it's really funny too because as I was looking through my play sheet today, some of it's been replaced. There's some new pages in here. Mm -hmm. So I don't I know how long ago you did that. Sheets. Well, no, I like it, but I just I don't know how long ago yeah. you put that on there. Not, <laughs> but not gonna not say anything it. either, but we didn't get any experience for our festival activities. Oh, I know. Because we're transitioning away from experience, we're going to do milestones now. Okay. 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 Because, one... We never keep track of actual experience, I'm just, we just level. I just get tired of dealing with experience, and the higher level that you get... Well, the more it is. It gets, like, stupidly high in terms okay. of how much experience points you need to level okay. up. And I just don't... It's frustrating, and mm. I just don't want to have to deal with it. So, so I'm going to tell you... Yeah. Level 15 is where I want to get with my character. Well, that's when I'll have. We'll see. That's when I'll, keep playing that's the when way I'll you keep have, playing. Yeah, yeah well, uh, we'll, we'll see what happens. Well, if my warlock dies before then, it will. <laughs> what the fuck have you been doing on this ship, Evander? Oh, you know, watching an orgy. What have you been doing? <laughs> <laughs> like, after we're done, Gerald, I want to ask you a question about my character. Mara does it I don't even do anything. I'm just like, nah. <laughs> <laughs> no, like... She's throwing it around. I'm just like, oh, I'm good. I'm good. My, my eyes are very open. 
I know. I saw her talking to everyone like this. <laughs> I did not talk to that bitch, honestly. I know. I saw who you were talking to. Don't you hook up with uh, I know, but this chick right here? No. I don't know who she is. I walk up to her. I'm like, she, she, she's the cleric. Oh. Her? She's the cleric? I'm like, yeah. please. I'm hurt. Lower. <laughs> Lower. <laughs> Higher. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes. Anyway, entering sea boat. <laughs> so now you set sail Have away a nice from Cab Fair. Away from Pygaren, and you're on your way to Chagas, and you There's get no far enough yeah. out that all around the ship now, all you can see is ocean. Nice. Okay. It's a little bit disconcerting. But you have I'm, a pretty decent navigator. I'm not disconcerned at all. Well, I know. <laughs> By the way, um, I'm not concerned. I love water. <laughs> I can swim hey, and fly. Knock the one head on top. I used to be a pirate. <clears throat> huh? Nothing. I used I'm to be a vampire. vampire. I thought I used. To, I thought I can swim and fly, and I used to be a pirate. I'm not oh, concerned about yeah, being yeah. surrounded by I ocean. Know. <laughs> <clears throat> and um, in the distance, I won't even make you roll any kind of perception checks here. In the distance, we see it. <laughs> in in the direction that you're going, you see some dark clouds. Bum, bum, bum. Mm -hmm. And there's a big storm coming. All right. Mm -hmm. I can breathe underwater. I'm fine. Right. <laughs> there's some preparations that have to be done. Back down it. the hatches and all that kind of fun stuff. It. My corded muscles gleaming. <laughs> glistening. Uh, <laughs> are you right, still so a bear? You're still a bear, right? No, yeah. work. So we have to like prep down the hatches and all that shit to survive. There's going to be some things. Yes, yeah, so you have some actions to do before the storm hits. Okay, so I'm going to ask the I'm captain gonna... <laughs> this question. Who would be the best two people for me to make fly to get the ship ready? What is your obsession with flying? Yeah, <laughs> because uh, people can fly gone, around the ship and get it ready for the fly. storm. Oh, bad idea. Okay, so think That's about two people idea. flying around not the not ship idea. and getting it ready for the storm. Well, windy, versus yeah. all of us. The wind doesn't affect you okay. when I'm using my fly spell. Right. So uh, you uh, yeah, and and is your history sailor as well? No, I'm a soldier. Soldier, but okay. I'm. A badass. I mean, like, that was her. No, okay. she's just... Never mind. It's hot girl. Okay. So. It's fine. Um, he would be the best two people to put fly on. At that... this point, actually, everyone here at this point, because you've been sailing with, with this crew for two, ten days already, so you kind of have a good feel for sea legs. <laughs> where you would well, best, be fake. best work. You know that in this case it would be Impsh and then the kind of big dude that's uh, Stump. That's 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 next to Impsh. This guy. That no. guy. Big dude. He's kind of a big human. Right. And no, those are just... uh, so you cast fly on them. Yeah. And they get to work up top, like Main gathering sails. up the sails and getting getting it all tied down. Listening. So much better than corded climbing. muscles. <laughs> Listening. Yeah, well, think, well, my, well, favorite, okay. my favorite it's time okay. using it's that exciting. spell it's was okay. when you were like, you have to carry this. Yeah, very good. Last time I was here in the queue, you have to carry this girl after all that battle. I was like, so. I'm going to cast fly on her and she can just fly. I want her to notice my glistening muscles. Fuck carry and shit. Yeah. yeah. Girl. You're flying around and fixing this shit. She's just to be able to see my 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 corded muscles. That's what I want. I need you to make, uh, give me a strength check, please. Oh. Let's hope I'm well shitty. A Athletics. Oh, nope, he got that. I will that allow... Huh? Yeah, yeah 20? Plus yeah. 9 to 29. Oh, shit. All right, yeah. You are, like, rocking it up there. <laughs> yeah. 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 Muriel Getting is everything. so wet right now. <laughs> I hope that's what it's not too late. Late. Not, I It's not bad. I believe sailing. <laughs> Oh man, Evander. <laughs> yeah, I need you because you you probably spent a lot of time off and on with <laughs> with uh, kind of taking ships with Sai and then some other right. folks. Yeah, being Prospects up in the up. crow's nest. So that's kind of where you are right now. Okay, is in the crow's nest, kind of looking 
looking around. I need you to make a perception check for me. What is that? Eleven. Dirt. No, thirteen. Dirt. I can't read your fucking eyes. Those things are so hard Thirteen. To perception. Where is it? Uh, sixteen. Sixteen. You only plus three? Mm -hmm. Wow. Alright. <laughs> Not that wise. I no. want to do some. Oh, well, wait. Are you proficient in. Wait. Oh, Are you wisdom. proficient in perception? I am, actually. What's your wisdom here. modifier? Uh, plus Not seven. Uh-huh. Well, up here. It's wisdom. No, no, no. So, it's plus four. What's your wisdom? <laughs> we need a drink when we get home. Plus, plus uh, four? Yeah, it's 18. So you get plus eight yeah, to gross. perception if it's trained. Is perception not trained? No. Okay, well then it would just that's be all the alcohol plus whatever it's uh, right wisdom. So, yes, so that would I mean, I have four. drugs. So you have one drug. Yeah, we'll yeah, plus four. Okay. Okay. That okay. okay. actually takes yeah. 17. Tonight. It's going to be... Spectacular. Well, I have I have yeah. a wide variety of the ship. Uh, well, you notice that I like I like play infection. There seems well. to be movement in sweet. the water. Oh, that. Okay, so is not on, on camera. Natural. That's fun. Or like okay. normal. How do you play Dark Souls Three, Bob? All right. Mm -hmm. So the game's frustrating. Have you played it, Gerald? Yes. But we're playing D&D right now, so give me a second. We'll talk about it on, on break. I didn't say anything, <laughs> but... Okay. But you were about to. I was, but I didn't. Uh, all right, so... All right, so I, I, I noticed that. On the ship, yeah. Yeah, I'm who's... Uh, so I'm like, I'm like right here, right? You can play music with Mara to kind of get them... Just, just pepped up? Yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. Oh, awesome. Give me a performance check. Awesome. All right. Uh, oh, you man. You have nature... That's a yes, lot. Yes, 27. Everyone has nature now. Yep. Right. Yeah. Oh, I so, already had it, though. Give me a nature check. <laughs> I rolled a 27 on performance, by the way. Uh, That's nice. 19. That's pretty, it's pretty, 19 pretty is good. good. 19 is very good. So you notice it as... Uh, oh, I can inspire everybody. Like, like, with like There's not a lot of movement above the water, as far as like anything coming up out. But you noticed what's your uh Charlatan? Oh, I'm probably No, you're a charlatan too. Oh, no. I knew it. Oh uh, <laughs> the camera's good, so. Yeah. And the cord. But that much here. That yeah, that monster's been that works. getting to you, man. Oh, oh, the monster's right. gotten to you knocking shit. The out. movement that you notice that you kinda of see down in there it seems to be coming right. from creatures. Thank you. Multiple. Like, see you know, like merfolk type creatures. All right. Mm. Mm. Uh, you t <laughs> is there like, is there? I guess since I'm in the crow's nest, there's some way they communicate. You can call down. I can just yell at them. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> okay. I was thinking there's like a bell or something or you know whatever. All right. So I are merfolk down. bad? Not necessarily. Depends right. on the type of merfolk. Yeah. I'm like, I look down, I'm like, there's merfolk in dim waters up in front of us. And I look at, I look at you, actually, because you're about the captain anyways. So, I, I, I yell at you. kind of call down yeah. that there's movement about in the water movement. ahead. And they, uh... Are they coming towards she, us, too? I'm guessing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like, she, she starts calling out orders <laughs> and they start preparing um, for combat. It may not result in combat, but they're kind of just they're getting just. getting prepared. Can, for can I uh, actually want to go up as she's shouting orders and be like, "What? Like, I'm still here. Like, I uh, play music. Uh, good performance. Everybody's happy, having a good time. Your sword bow. And I want to say, uh, we've never been here. What what should we expect in this sort of situation? What what should we prepare for? Um, it really depends on what what they want. We may have to fight. They may just be passing through. Have you have you been in this area before? Like, yeah, you, yeah, we've passed this way before. Is it just hit or um, miss, really? Yeah, That's merfolk, funny. kind of, they're pneumatic. They move around a lot. Um, I'm not surprised you're into them this far out. Okay. Uh, Can I go yeah. talk to the merfolk? Well, actually, that's a great question. Dragons? And what happens is... I don't know, I don't know what they are. As they get closer, I'm so and like, looks into the camera. Oh, 
a lot of the sailors are still like tying things down and getting getting it just doing their jobs. Yeah, getting getting things prepared for weathering the storm. Um, at the front of the ship, up, kind of there's there's kind of a splash sound and up. Like swimming up with enough speed, kind of gets high enough to land right here, and it's it's a merfolk person, kind of weird looking, bluish skin, got gills on their neck, on on his neck, and he has. Is he kind of scaly? He's a little scaly. Yeah, he has like scales. I'm gonna move. <laughs> kind of. I'm gonna move my kind character of. up. Just kind of. We have some scaly. We have that. Ch- I have um, scales. You have scales. Uh, uh, give me things that don't matter for five hundred. <laughs> no, go up there. That's yeah. fine. That's it not. A, that's not the worst thing that you can do. Well, no well, that was gonna yeah. be. A, that was gonna be a conversation huh. starter. Does anyone here? Are we not gonna talk, or are they just gonna attack us? Does anyone here? See no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. If it's orc or common, then yes. I certainly Elvish. do. Elvish. Brudic. Common. Um, Look at the language. I was born to speak. Not some language you've ever seen before. <laughs> Does it speak <laughs> giant? <laughs> Belena doesn't even speak common. Does it speak Aquan? <laughs> no. I'm going to cast tongues on myself. Oh God, he's we're great. <laughs> great. He's our different. Actually, guy. actually, oh. hold on, hold on. I'm gonna hold rephrase on. it. I'm hold gonna. On. I have a. Are you talking about covering I'm, languages? I have a spell. It's called I have a, I have a it's spell. It's called tongues. Yeah. I, w- I would have seen this comprehend languages. I have it written down. This tongues. Is that not like talk to people? No, it's uh, comprehend language, and I'm totally going to, to, to. To cast that on myself, like, you can. Yeah. Like I'm not sure what tongue this does. I'm not sure either. Hold up. Is that even a spell? Did I you have it written up? down. <laughs> Did you make tongue spell? Tongue, I don't tongues, know. Tongues is a spell. I got it. I got the app out. What does it do? So, the spell grants the creature you touch the ability to understand any spoken language it hears. Moreover, when the target speaks, any creature that knows at least one language. They can hear the target understands what it says. Mm-hmm. So ah. probably wouldn't recommend touching the dude and casting. But you like have to him. you have to touch it. And and Paul, you can totally mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. <Hello>. So <laughs> How are actually you? I'm gonna rephrase my action. I'm gonna be here. Yeah. I'm gonna walk up. No, 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 here. Paul, well, here's what you need to do, okay? I'm also gonna go touch the captain. No, when you're I gonna. Touch, you're. You wanna touch I think the, me? I, no, I wanna touch the captain. Well, if I'm gonna use comprehend language, I can understand. I can't speak it. So if you tell me, I can speak it. Okay. Well. Um, then, I, wait. I have an idea, guys. Do you speak common? <laughs> <laughs> let's just let's just throw that out there before we start casting okay. spells and shit. Do you speak common? Well, see, I get all I idea. get all my spells back on the short he, breath, so he. Kind of swims up, and by the way, he does have like a like kind of a fish, a good fish idea, sort of tail. Actually. He looks a little bit like well, this, this mm-hmm. is a woman, but yeah. kind of a male form okay. out of this. Yeah, okay. okay. Uh, it's a good idea. And good job, Emsh. Good job, Emsh. We high five. Give the, me. Does he uh, speak in common? Give me insight rolls, please. For those of you who can see him. Well, I'm in the air, so I assume I can roll see. Roll for size as well here. <clears throat> Where's my oh, nice roll. A nice spin of the guy. He really. Yeah. I know you. Twenty for size. I'm looking for Wait, my Wait, what do we have? Insight. insight. Oh you man, have... you're good at insight. You got a seven. I'm a D twenty here. Oh, you, go? Man, you got a nineteen. That's good. Yeah. Man. So twenty six. Hey, you guys are good. Thirteen for damage. I don't know what Blaine is like. I mean, I got a twelve. Never mind. She's downstairs. I got. I got twenty one. I got. 17. I don't know either. It was like sixteen. 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 That's good. That's a good thirteen for him. None and of you have ever angry. seen a murder person before. Um, I have been to my pirating adventures. Probably not. Although it's been a long time, we'll say that. 
What did you roll? A four. Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. But so he 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 calls out in Aquin. You ask him if he speaks common, and he's gonna revert because he he, he he does speak common, actually. Nice. Um, see, nice. see, simple. We're we're overthinking and these guys. <laughs> inspiration. He. Uh, <laughs> I'll give you inspiration for that, sure. Right. Yeah, that's actually a pretty good idea. Right. So hold on, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna cast tongue. I'm gonna touch myself and yeah. cast tongues on myself. He's gonna speak common at you guys. Oh well, then never mind. <laughs> Pay attention. All right, that's what he says. Uh, <laughs> you notice for those of you who rolled reasonably high on the insight, notice that. What would you call reasonably high? Not <laughs> what Nagri rolled. At yeah, least not a 15. four. Oh damn, it, I got thirteen. Sai <laughs> so so notices it, and it's 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 unnerving. But like this guy, is pretty powerful looking. He has a uh, he has a spear. Hi, I'm awkward. Now. It's 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 a it's not a trident. Ah. It's it's a I guess we call it a bident. It's got two. Okay. It's like a fork <laughs> fork spear. And his eyes are really big, but they're. They're wide as well, and he seems a bit hyperventilated. And he says <laughs> one word: run. Uh oh. Actually, no. He says two words: run, kraken. Oh. <laughs> and then dives back into the water, and they swim. As fast as they can. What a nice guy. Away. So we should. Muriel. No, here's the it. word Kraken. And begins yelling out orders to basically undo the sails. <laughs> on it. <laughs> and to, for people to get on the rune cannons. There are. Let me. Let me. She's. She wants to fight this motherfucker. In case they well, have obviously to. Yeah. we're gonna fight it. Well, why would she take the sails down? Why to would we be away. taught how but to use the rune cannons yeah, if we weren't going to okay. fight a kraken? Okay. Uh, there stones. are. Let me get dice here uh, to represent the cannons. We'll make them d fours so that there's no confusion. Be six. All right. So, hang on. I, I set her up. The dwarf guy's like running to and fro. I think that's the die you're looking for. Convenient that I'm flying. I will not take a cannon, but I will just be a well, bear. Now just be a bear. Come on. You, need to you need to come back to me real fast with your flying. I want to recast fly on different people. Wait. So I can't use fly. I'm going to recast it on you as one of them as long as you come back to me so I can touch you. Okay. Otherwise, mm. when it's my turn first time, you might be screwed. <laughs> okay. Got it. You take down the sail first. <laughs> and well, no, you're, you're flying right now. I mean, if you want to go ahead and take it down. In, in the distance, the, the kind of reasonably far ahead of the ship, probably about... 1,500 feet All right. ahead. And the storm clouds are coming. Kind of too. Like stole that from you, but, but <laughs> you see um, really very briefly this, this enormous uh, tentacle just like, like kind of come up out of the water and then like slam back so down. You should, mm. you should move back to me as soon as you can. And we're gonna... <laughs> We're gonna take a break, I think. Yeah, let's go. Let's go and uh, prepare for this because we're out of time. Oh boy. Later. I'm gonna pee real fast. Oh man.